data drives decisions. But a survey distributed to hundreds of companies that fills 62 pages draws one conclusion. There's always work to do. Lauren Castile is the CEO of the Women's Foundation of Colorado, an organization focused on gender, racial, and economic equity. Data is important, but every data point is a human being. And that's what matters. In the data collected by the McKinsey and Company survey showed where the trouble areas are. The survey claims to be the largest study of women in corporate America and is in its seventh year. With more than 400 participating companies and 65,000 people surveyed, it showed despite DEI trainings over the last year, women of color continue to face bias and discrimination. And according to the survey, even though the number of white employees who identify as allies to women of color have increased, the number of them taking action as an ally has not. Um, when we talk about inclusion, it's not just having a seat at the table, it's having a voice at the table to be a part of decision making. Here in Colorado, Castile says she's working with Colorado Inclusive Economy to dig deep on how they can develop practices that can bring not only equity, but representation into the workplace. While there is not just one solution, she hopes all will contribute to drive the data in a better direction. It's a spirit of generosity and a commitment to our community as a whole. Jalisa Rosari, Nine News. The survey also concluded that women's representation improved across all levels at the corporate pipeline in 2020. We've got a link to the survey on 9news.com. Just click on the story.